So this is a little, little more than y'all definitely, this is definitely a lot more than y'all saw last time, but I've gotten a little farther into it and this is what it's looking like. I'm not really happy with it yet. There's some pretty like significant gaps like right here. And as you can see, this doesn't lift up, which is also rather unfortunate. I was just pulling that out of its place because it's not secured properly. I had to move these back to here because this would hit up here and it's kind of messed up everything actually. There's too much pressure on all the gears, but that's whatever for right now. I need to cover up this stuff. So as you can see on this side, whoops. I just used these pieces. I don't think that looks terrible, but I need to stick. I don't have one near me, like something like this over here to just cover that up a little better. Oh, here's, wait, no, that's not one. Never mind, never mind. Like, like they have here. I mean, I wanna do something like this. That's out of place, it's okay. Um, so that's what we're going for on this side. And then in the front, I just need to figure out what the heck I'm doing, cause I really don't know. So I'm gonna keep on adding on, fix the other side and fill in the gaps back here and I'll get back with it. So I took a slightly uh, different approach and stuck these on here instead. I don't know, I just thought I had more of these, honestly. That's what I was thinking, so I just did that instead. That is really bad. I don't know why that's suddenly fallen down so much, but uh, I'll fix that. Um, it's like this piece is wobbling. like this piece here it's actually just moving up and down i guess something came loose in there but regardless i have this and there's a little bit of a gap back here which i'm not too happy with there's less of a gap here like at the top but i can still clean that up a little bit but just for like a little bit of work i don't think it's terrible i want to fix this still so i'm going to get back on that and i'll show you what it looks like when i actually clean it up this time I promise I'll problem do. solved let's go we got these on the back it doesn't look great but that's okay um i don't really remember if i showed this last time but i don't care this lifts up now so we have all sorts of room and what i'm gonna do for the rest of this is fill this with space for things and uh oh i don't know what that did to the video but never mind moving on with things and stuffs Look at how well that closes. And this isn't like seamless by any means, but I don't think it's honestly terrible. Like here's the original, here's mine. There's more space here fairly obviously and um, here, but I don't really know what to do about that. Neither do I really care all that much. It's my build. I get to do what I want. So I'm gonna put some seats in there and I'll show y'all that when I finish with it. To be honest, I'm really happy with how many people I can fit back in here. So you open it up and voila, you got five 501st troopers and like there's still like a decent amount of room. Like I could put a gun rack if I really wanted to because we've got all this side space and the back was gonna be a little packed just in all honesty to begin with, just I didn't really know what I was doing. So the fact that you can even fit this many and it's like, you could technically do that in the old one, but it's just so cramped, it didn't feel right. It just didn't work as well. And so in this one, I feel like you can actually fit five guys pretty comfortably, which I'm pretty excited about. And so then next time, oh, whoopsies, I'm going to do the front half of this. So we'll get, stick this back down. And we've got that. Whoopity do. Oh, I need to add on it. Never mind. We're gonna do the front half of this, but you can see we've got it all completed from the back right now. So let me get a little side angle of this. Y'all can see how it looks. Let me know what you think in the comments. Like and subscribe, thanks for I realized for I really didn't do a lot in that video, which I didn't want to happen. I didn't want the series to just go downhill quickly, which it kind of did in that video. So I figured, well, while I'm here, might as well make our awesome turret that spins around at supersonic speeds. So <laughs> I thought I was slick. Turns out I'm a moron because this did not work how I anticipated it working. So now I've got to, well, I want to make the turret look better. We're going to get rid of these things because they're stupid. And then I have to figure out how to gear down the turret. But I'm going to get started on that in this video instead of holding it off for another video. So I'm gonna make a little gear train for this thing and I'll get back to y'all once that's done. I've slowed down the system. Hold up, let's see if I can. Uh-oh, okay, there we go. So it's still pretty quick, but it's like 
not as uh, not as quick as it was by any means. Um, I'd really like to use one of these and then slow it down with like one of the super super small ones, but I can't seem to find any of those gears sitting around anywhere. So, well, this is this is something, and I'll work on it from here. Next video, I'll get it mounted. But now I can clickbait everyone by saying with working guns. So thanks for watching.